On Monday, a nationwide general strike in Israel disrupted many services and businesses as public pressure on Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu intensified. The strike, led by Israel's largest trade union Histadrit, aimed to force Netanyahu into a ceasefire agreement following the recovery of six hostages' bodies from Gaza. Key sites, including Ben Gurion Airport and numerous private businesses, participated in the strike. Protesters criticized Netanyahu for his handling of negotiations with Hamas and demanded more action to secure the release of hostages. Despite the strike scale, not all regions joined in, reflecting deep political divisions. The labor court ordered the strike to end by the afternoon. Netanyahu has maintained a hardline stance, insisting on military control over certain areas, which has complicated ceasefire talks. The conflict has resulted in significant casualties, with over 40,000 people killed in Gaza since the October 7 Hamas attack.